Hi guys, welcome to AT Land. Today I'm just going to quickly show you how I customize my ROG ally and how to apply animated wallpaper onto our ROG ally. And I'm going to showcase a little bit about my game collection in Play Night. So if you do not know what is Play Night, you can go back to my Play Night Ultimate tutorial. I go through how to set up each system, how to use all the shortcuts and some tricks and tips for Play Night. Play Night is a hub that we can set all our um, game stores as emulators and so on to one single place so this is pretty much like armory cray but a better version without those uh uh, Amory Cray settings, but yeah, I do love it better than Amory Cray. So I just use Amory Cray for my settings, and I generally use Play Night to start up when I turn on my PC, and I will just go straight to Play Night to launch my games. So here I am applying some stickers. I have remapped all my keys to Nintendo style, so I swapped the ABXY buttons. Uh, in uh, a different way and therefore I am putting some ABS XY buttons uh, stickers on my buttons and I am going to put one more extra sticker on the d-pad because I think this is looking a little bit dull and I really hope that there will be some third-party um, d-pad uh, mods that i can use because i don't really like it to be black but anyway that's the only thing i have right now so yes here i am putting on some stickers and that's pretty much the customization that i can f do for the time being because there is totally lack of accessories and the official uh, travel case is out of stock in here so yeah that's pretty much what i can do and here is a showcase of my play night collection it is really nice because you can launch your game directly from here even android games and microsoft apps you can launch it from here so if you want to watch some netflix or disney plus you can also add it to here to play and you can add some other music or um, video players here so it's just really up to you how to set it up i'm using the full screen mode and uh, i launch it right when i turn on my window so i really really love it so okay, let me show you a quick example how to use Play Night. Just click play uh, in that game and then it will launch up your, uh, for example here, I use PCSX2 for PlayStation 2. So it will directly launch into the game and I don't have to worry about all those windows and settings every time because I've already set it up and it is just simple and beautiful. Once I uh, finish the game, I can uh, close the window and then it will go directly back to Play Night. At the beginning of this video, I use a beautiful 8-bit animated Zelda wallpaper. Um, and this is actually by uh, this um, artist called Itza. And I'm going to put down the link to his uh, Kofi shop. Um, so actually it's free to use or uh, to download his work. You just have to um, write down your email account and your nickname. And well, of course there are um, HD version and 4K version. So if you want to use 4K version, you will have to pay for it. But uh, if not, the HD version is free of charge. So just download it. And uh, I'm going to talk you through how to apply animated uh, wallpapers. So basically, it is just a um, MPAP file, and then um, we will have to apply it. And there are also mobile versions. So if you want to use this kind of wallpapers on your phone, it is also possible. At Microsoft App Store, there is a free app called Lively Wallpaper. You can use skip file or use um, some videos to uh, as your animated wallpaper. You can set it to launch at the start of Windows and it will automatically launch 
in uh, and show the animated wallpaper as your wallpaper. Okay, so this is the screen you will see in lively wallpaper. There are several things that you can set. Um, please set a launch as the start of Windows and that's pretty much it. Um, for the other settings, it just really depends on you. So um, you don't really have to worry that much. Okay, so now let's add the mp4 file to the lively wallpaper. Just double click the file and then uh, click OK, then it will automatically import it. And then uh, you click save. Then uh, after that, it will take some time to load. And after loading, it will appear here. And then we can go to the hamburger menu to set it as wallpaper. It will take a few seconds. And after that, we will be able to see the wallpaper on our desktop. Perfect. Okay, so the next thing you would probably think is that the taskbar is quite getting in your way. So you can go to personalization in the settings and go to taskbar and then turn on automatically high taskbar so that it will not appear all the time and it will minimize as much as possible. If you want to make my PC and recycle bin disappear, you can simply go to personalization and themes and choose what to appear on your desktop. You can also change the color of your taskbar in personalization, but you have to um, make sure you are using the dark theme instead of the light theme. So that's pretty much about this video and I will make more follow-up video on ROG Ally. See you in my next video. Bye!